here from a far eastern land across the sea. A young man who has yet to know his potential. This potential... Fuxa! Real son! Fuxa!
forgive me for leaving you alone. What? What are you saying? Father! Your friends. Keep friends. Those you love close to you. Uh, no. Father! No! for Hazuki-sensei. Dio-san, you should still be resting. Uh, I'm fine, really. And you? Are you alright? <sighs> yes, but I must keep busy, otherwise I'll get depressed. I understand. But you needn't work too hard. <sighs> yes. Oh, by the way, I have this for you. This is for today. From tomorrow, I'll leave it on top of the shoe cabinet every day. Do you know where Fuksan is? Fukara-san? I believe he's in the dojo. Really? Thanks.
Ine-san. Yo-san. You must be tired. Perhaps you should rest. I'm fine. If I don't keep busy, I'll get depressed, you know. That's just like you, Ine-san. Well, just don't overwork yourself. Yes. See you. Keep your balance. That's right. Hey! <laughs> now listen. Tighten up your abdomen. Straighten up. Find your center of balance. Yes, like that. Yosan, is everything okay? Don't worry, I'm fine. I want to ask you about that man. Oh, that man. Uh... The man called Landi. What did he talk with my father about? Landi demanded the mirror, and 
Then they threw me out of the dojo. The black suits catch the names? I don't know. They came out of nowhere. I see. Thanks, Fukusan. If you remember anything at all, be sure to tell me. Ryo-san, why? What you gonna do? Ryo-san, where are you going? You're not going after them. Please don't. Look what they did to Hazuki-sensei. They killed my father right in front of me. I will have my revenge. I need to do this for my father. Ichiro. Hey, bro. Noriko. Ryo. About that day. That day? Ah, uh, the day of the incident. I heard about it from Nozomi. It must be hard for you. No, I'm fine. Did you see any men wearing black suits that day? No, I didn't. What about them? It's nothing, really. Ichiro. Yo. I want to ask you something. Yeah? What is it? That day. Did you see any men wearing black suits? That day? Uh... No, I didn't see them. I see. Any idea of who may have seen them? Hmm. How about Mishima-san or Kondo-san? Those women just might know something. You know, they're always near the payphone in Sakuragaoka. Standing there chatting and gossiping all day. Yeah. Maybe they know and are chatting about it now. I'll ask them. Thanks. Hey. Hi, mister! Wanna play with me? Sorry. Maybe later, okay? Hi there. Hiya! Are you looking for something? Nothing, really. Hi, Megumi. Uh, uh, you got a kitten in there? You promise not to tell my mommy? Sure. Okay, then I'll show you. Is this your kitten? Uh-uh. But this kitty, see? She's all alone. All alone? Yep. 
see the other day when it rained, a car ran over her mommy. My big sister saw it. She said it was a big black car. A black car? Yeah, and she said it was really scary. And then me and sis, we buried the mommy cat. And so now, I can be the kitty's mommy. But mommy says we can't keep the kitten at home. So you're going to keep her here? Yeah, everybody's helping out too. Like Kota, Yasuo, and Kayo. I see. Kitty don't look so good. Think she's hungry? Hmm. Wait a second. Okay. Do this, so it's easier to eat. Hmm? Wow, she's eating! She's so tiny, but already an orphan. It's so sad! Yamagishi-san almost got ran over too! Yamagishi-san? Yeah, the car was going so fast, he got shocked and fell! And hurt his backside, so now he stays home all day. When I go to the candy shop, I always stop by to visit him. Yeah, it's close by there. Megumi, you need to be careful around cars too. Yes. Well, I've got to go now. But wait! We gotta think of a name for the kitty! Oh, well, when I think of a good one, I'll let you know. You promise? Bye-bye, Dio! Bye-bye. Perhaps they're out? I don't think anybody's in. No one's home? Perhaps they're out? Mishima-san. Oh, hello, Ryo. That day of the incident, did you see some men dressed in black suits? Black suits? No. I didn't see them. Well, did you happen to notice anything unusual? Oh, nothing worth mentioning. I'm looking for anything at all. Is there anything you remember? I'm sorry, Ryo. The weather was awful. So I stayed inside all day. Did you ask Sumia-san? She knows about everything that occurs in this neighborhood. Is that so?
Um... Oh, hello, yo. Kondo-san, the day of the incident, did you see any men in black suits? The day of the incident? You mean the day it thundered, right? I didn't see them. I see. Did anything unusual happen around here that day? Not that I'm aware of. But you know, Sumia-san knows about everything that goes on around here. It'd be good if you tried asking Sumia-san. I see. Excuse me. So sorry. I have to go now. I see. Sumia-san. Hi, Byo. On the day of the incident, did you see some men in black suits? In black suits? No, I didn't. But I did see a cat, though. You mean a black cat? Yes, it was run over by a car. A kitten was crying nearby. I also saw little Megumi crying with it. I see. Was there anything else unusual about that day? Now that you mention it, Yamakishi-san took a terrible spill at the corner by the park. He was trying to dodge a speeding car. Looked as if he hurt his back. I think it was the same car that hit the cat. It must have been going really fast. So, that's what happened. Excuse me? Yes? What's this name, plate say? It says Tajima. Does it? I'm trying to find the Yamamoto's house, but see my eyesight is bad, so... Don't worry. I'll look for it. Wait for me in that park up ahead. You're so kind. Thank you so much. Now, Yuki. Yo! Got a sec? Sure. Hey, is everything okay? Yeah, but hey, on that day, did you see any men wearing black suits? Black suits? No, I sure didn't. I see. Any idea who might know about those men in black suits? Hmm. Maybe Sakura Gaoka Gossip Gaggle might know something. You know how they're always yakking over near the payphone. Try asking them. Good idea. Yamagashi-san. Oh, it's you, Leo. How is your back? Yes, it's much better. But how did you know? I heard from someone in the neighborhood that you almost got ran over by a car. Well, it must have been Megumi or Sumiya-san who told you. That driver was insane. Could you tell me about what happened with that car? Sure. This black car came flying around the corner over by Sakura Gaoka Park and went towards uh, Dubuita. A black car? Did you see the license plate number? Maybe, if there hadn't been any snow. And to make matters worse, I fell over. 
so I never had the chance. Oh, well, I'm glad to hear you're okay. No one's home? I don't think anybody's in. Hi. Hey, mister! Let's play baseball! Sorry, maybe later, okay? Hey. Hi, mister! You wanna wrestle? Some other time, okay? Excuse me. What is it, baby boy do? Did you see a black car the day of that incident? I didn't see anything. Because with all the snow, my shop was packed with children. I see. Did anything unusual happen that day? You again. With me, every day it's the same old routine. I see. Use your head, baby boy do. Yes. Excuse me. Oh, hi there. Perhaps they're out? No one's home? I don't think anybody's in. Perhaps they're out? Yeah, Makashi san. Oh, it's you, Leo. Your back seems to be better. Yes, it's much better. Have you found it? The Yamamoto's house? No, not yet. Wait here a bit longer, please. I thought it was around here. I'm sorry to trouble you. Hiya. Oh, hi, Leo. What you doing? Drawing a picture. What you drawing? A doll. That's pretty good. Eddie. Huh? On that day when it snowed, did you see a black car? Do you think I notice each and every car that passes through here? Oh. Oh, wait a minute. 
Oh, I might have heard something about it yesterday. Who was talking about that car? I'd tell you if I remembered, but I heard someone talking about it over at the seafood shop. Oh. I don't think anybody's in. Noriko. Bill. That day, did you see a black car? The day of the incident? No, I didn't see it. After all, the weather was bad and it was freezing cold, wasn't it? I was at home all day and didn't leave. I see. Excuse me? Who's there? I'm Dio Hazuki from Yamanose. I need to ask you something. I'm sorry, but I'm a little busy now. I see. Well, it's no big deal. They're out. Got a minute? Huh? Get out of my space, schoolboy! Excuse me. Huh? Who the hell you think you are? closed. I don't think anybody's in. No one's home? They're out. I don't think anybody's in.
Perhaps they're out? No one's home? Perhaps they're out? No one's home? Mayumi. Hey, Ryo. What's up? It's about the day of the incident. You saw the black car hit the cat, didn't you? How did you know that? Megumi told me. That little chatterbox. I'm sorry. That's all she talks about lately is that kitten. That's all right. Can you tell me about the black car? About the car, not the cat? Right. Um, sorry, but all I can remember is that the car was black. I see. The door's locked. Do you have a minute? I'm sorry. I don't talk to strangers. Sorry. Bye now. Hi. Hi, mister! Let's play soccer! Some other time, okay? Do you have a minute? Sorry, but I don't talk to strangers. If you're trying to pick me up, forget it. Find someone else. Akasaka-san. Hi, Ryo. That day, did you see a black car? A black car? I hear it came from Sakuragaoka and drove through Double Ita at full speed. Hmm. I had no idea. I see. Ryo. Why don't you try asking people on the shopping street? Maybe someone saw it down there. Yeah? No one's home? I don't think anybody's in. No one's home? Perhaps they're out? It's closed. Welcome to Lapis. I've been expecting you. Excuse me? You are worried about something, yes? Yes. Shall I read your fortune then? It's 300 yen per reading. Yes, please. Well, what type of reading would you like? Please tell me a clue. Very well. Hrumpf. Mm-hmm. Aha! Uh -huh. I can see it now! A young girl surrounded by flowers may show you the way. I see. 
Shall I do another reading for you? No, thank you. Well then, please come again when you seek guidance. I will. Goodbye. I get for you? I have a question for you. Do you remember the day when the snow changed to rain? Yeah, I remember. Did you happen to see a black car? A black car? Oh, hey, that reminds me. You know that girl over at Ida Florist, yeah? You mean Nozomi? Yup. She was spitting mad because some black car splashed mud on her. I don't know the details, though. I see. Nozomi. Ryo, have things settled down for you any? Yeah. If there's anything I can do, be sure to let me know. Yeah. On that day the snow changed to rain. I heard you were splashed with mud from a speeding car. Yeah. What kind of car was it? It was black, and the kind of luxury car you don't normally see around here. Did you see who was in the car? No, I didn't. It was too fast. But I heard a rumor that Tom had an argument with the people in the car. Do you mean Tom at the hot dog truck? Yeah. Why are you asking about that car? No reason. See you later. Ryo. Hmm? Cheer up, will ya? Yeah. See you. About that black car? Talk about reckless driving. Why don't you ask at Ida Florist? I see. Uh, are you alright? I'm just fine and dandy. <laughs> Are you sure? I'm okay. Yuriko-san. Oh, Ryo. There's something I want to ask you. Sorry, I have something to do now. Next time, okay? Sure, no problem. See you later. Tom. Hey, Ryo! Tell me about those men in the black car. What? Nozomi told me you had words with the guys driving the black car. No, no, I don't remember. They might have been the ones who murdered my father. Your father? Please try to think. All right, man, I'll try. Those guys in the black car, what were they like? I saw a guy wearing this weird coat. What kind of coat? It was a deep green. Maybe velvet or silk. Like something Chinese. That's Landy. What happened? They almost hit one of my customers, so I gave them a piece of my mind. But that man, he gave me this glare. I ain't never seen such a cold stare, man. Do you remember anything else? Nope. Try asking Chinese people about Chinese. Do you know any Chinese? Sorry, man. But see that travel agency over there? They get some Chinese customers. I'll ask around for you too, man. Come by later. Sure.
Excuse me. Yes? I'm looking for someone who knows about Chinese people. Do you know anyone? Why don't you try the Chinese restaurant near the drugstore? You mean the Ajiji? Yes. I'm sure their employees are all Chinese. Thank you very much. Kurita-san. Yo, how are ya? Who's the best person in town to ask about people from China? People from China? What was the name of that place? You know, that Chinese restaurant at the far end. The Ajiichi? Yeah, that's it. I don't eat there much, but... The owner. He's Chinese, I think. That's right. Son. Yes? Are there any other Chinese people around here? Why do you want to know about other Chinese? Uh, nothing, really. Is it something to do with what happened to your father? Yes. Oh, no. Not all Chinese people are bad. I understand that. But the only clue I have is that they were Chinese. Please. Is there anything you could tell me? You say Chinese people around here? But there's quite a lot of them compared to before. We don't really know the newcomers. I see. Why don't you tell him about the Three Blades? Oh, the Three Blades. Three Blades? What are the Three Blades? It literally refers to three different blades that represent three different trades. The barber, the tailor, and the cook. They all use bladed tools. The barber uses a razor. The tailor uses scissors. And the cook uses knives. Ah, I get it. Most of the Chinese who came to Japan were one of the three. It doesn't cost much to set up. So you can start the business quickly. People of the Three Blades also know each other very well. It's a good idea to ask them if you're looking for information on people from China. Who are some of the Three Blade people around here? For the barber, visit Maeda-san. For the tailor, see Itoi-san, who's making patches now. For the cook, go and ask Mampu Cook and Namen. The Three Blade people should know about other Chinese people as well. Oh, there's also another barber shop, the Liu Barber and Hair Salon. But, but Liu Sun's father is in the hospital now. His family's having a hard time. The shop's been closed recently. So, I should go and speak with Maeda-san, Itoi-san, and Mam Pukuken Ramen, right? Yes. I see. Thank you very much.